What's going on, y'all boys? It's your girl, Joy, your favorite vegan chef. And of course, aha, the flyest vegan chef in the building. And today, okay, on today's episode of Fine, Fine, Lemon Lime. Fine, Fine, Lemon Lime, baby, Brandon on point. We got some jackfruit, all right? We got some jackfruit. I love to cook with jackfruit, the um, more vegetable form, the raw form, unripe form. But today, as you can see with all these little black on here, this might be a little more ripe than needed, but we have some ripe jackfruit on deck. I want to be cutting this open for you guys, showing you a little, a little behind the scenes of what it looks like to actually have ripe jackfruit, okay? Um, so let's get this party started. First things first, all right? Jackfruit has very a very sticky substance, substance to it, okay? It's like an adhesive. It'll get on your knife and, and gum it up, all right? So you want to put some oil. I'm using grapeseed oil here, but you can use coconut oil, olive oil, whatever. Whatever oil floats your boat. And you just want to line it up on your knife, okay? Scoop. Put that in here. You know, lubricate it nice and cute. Nice and cute. Keep it cute, guys. That's one thing that we do. <laughs> we keep it cute, okay? Uh, that's just what we're going to do over here. Bow. Wow, let me grab a little napkin right quick. There are a lot of ways to cut a jackfruit. Today, I'm going to use a method that I haven't used before, but I do want to try it out. And why not try it out with the Get Fine game? Come on. So I'm going to cut it in half and then I'm going to quarter it, okay? All right, guys, so we're going to just cut that in half. Mmm, boom, look at that. Check that out. All right, guys, so this is what the jackfruit looks like cut in half, okay? So now that we have this in half, we're just going to cut this half in half and then we're going to quarter it, okay? Start here. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Now we're going to cut this half in half, like I said. And there we have it, a nice little quarter of the jackfruit. Jackfruit does have seeds inside, as you can see. And you can boil these. Um, they have a lot of nutrients to them. You can boil them and have it as a snack. Matter of fact, I'll do a video for you guys. Show y'all. You know some different ways uh uses that you can get out of this jackfruit if you decide to buy a whole one from the store you see this little centerpiece right here you want to you want to get your get your we want to get it out the way okay so i'm gonna cut that and cut a little more bomb so now it's just giving you straight fruit okay it's nothing they're binding it together and what you can actually do Go like that, and they're just going to separate. You're just going to separate. And then you'll be able to take the pod out. So there's a bunch of individual pods all lined up in here. Bunch of them. Super cute. And they have seeds in the middle. Again, like I was telling you guys. Take the seed out. Then you can enjoy the fruit. I absolutely love jackfruit, especially ripe. I love to cook it, you know, brown stew, curry, whatever, whatever. But as the actual ripe fruit, I love jackfruit. It's very tropical. It tastes like pineapple and papaya and, 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 and banana and mango just had a baby. They just bow. And I, I absolutely love it. In fact, it smells like juicy fruit. Hmm. Or maybe juicy fruit smell like jackfruit. How about that? Because this was here long before juicy fruit even came around. So this smells like juicy fruit gum and it tastes impeccable. I love it. And yeah, that's a that's our tutorial on how to break it down.